you are going on a vacation. Wouldn't be amazing to bring home stunning sunset photo which you can then display in your house to keep your memory alive? In today's video, I'll teach you just that by simply using your smartphone only. My name is Azdenka Darola and I'm a professional photographer. All you need is your smartphone, you need to know when to take the photo and where exactly to stand. So I'm just waiting for a sunset and I'm waiting for that orange, brown, yellow, orange, uh, kind of reddish color. And right now it's about, I think it's close to six o'clock. It's February 2018. So if you're gonna wait in this time of the day, the sunset should be really pretty. And then all you have to do is just stick the camera very close to the pool to get the reflection. This is how it looks like right now at this point. The sun is going low, but it's not low yet, and it's not colorful. So I'm gonna wait a few more minutes until it gets really, really dark, and then we'll hopefully get a beautiful sunset photo. Here is an example how it looks like when the sun is a little bit too high. It's just too bright and dark. It's kind of muddy looking to me. There is no warmth to it. So just wait maybe five, 10 minutes longer and see what happens. So the time is here to take the best sunset photo. Now the sun has to be low like this, almost hiding behind the building. And all you have to do is to hold the camera very, very low to the pool, almost touching the water in a pool. Make sure you hold your phone with both hands. You don't wanna drop it in a pool or you can use a selfie stick. The phone will adjust camera on its own. All you have to do is just tilt tiny bit your camera in your hands up and down to find the best view. And I also move my phone a little bit to the right and a little bit to the left to get different scene. Make sure your horizontal line is straight and just snap away. You choose your final photos later on. You'll be very impressed what your phone can do. They don't even need to be edited, but if you like to, just hit the edit button, tone, and then bring the contrast a little bit to the right, which makes it a little bit stronger. And then play with the temperature setting. If you move it to the right, you get the warmer tones, more to the red. If you move it to the left, you'll get blue tones. So just keep playing with it until you come up with something you like. And once you choose your final photos, like we chose this one, all you have to do is print it on a beautiful canvas and hang it in your house. I hope you liked this video. If you would like to see more tutorials and tips on mobile photography, please don't forget to subscribe. If you have any questions, comments or requests on a special videos, please uh, post it in the video description below. Thank you for watching again. Ciao. Ahoy.